Hi, cześć, jak się masz? Today we're gonna be doing herb chicken or green chicken. So we're gonna be using lots of green herbs, some lemon, garlic, and a whole chicken. So what we need for this, let's start with the herbs. The herbs, and if you don't have some of them, that's all right. I'm using dill, oregano, parsley, basil, sage, thyme, rosemary, and majoram. I'm gonna use one lemon, four garlic cloves. We're gonna use salt and pepper, or if you have vegeta, or I have kucharek, this is like salt with seasonings. So I'm gonna use that, but if you don't have it, that's all right, you can just use regular salt. And a whole chicken. And then it's gonna be olive oil and we're gonna bake it. So let's start with spatchcocking the chicken. So I'll move this to the side. And all you need to do is cut along the backbone. You can do it with a knife or shears. And you can remove the other side too. I choose to leave the other side in, just easier for me. And then you wanna make a slit by the breastbone to split it. There you go. And we turn it around, press it down. It's nice and flat and ready to be seasoned. All right, so first, I'm gonna squeeze the lemon all over. And those pieces you can remove. I'm gonna put some, sorry, I have a couple plates and this thing keeps making noise. I'm gonna put some olive oil. And if you've noticed, I'm doing all the work and seasoning in the baking dish that I'm gonna use. You might call it lazy or genius. I prefer genius, <laughs> but I, don't like to have all these dishes left over, as you can hear what I have in the sink. <laughs> and now we're gonna start with the salt of the vegeta. And pepper. And for the seasonings, all the herbs, I did one tablespoon. And I would say half a tablespoon of pepper. Now we're gonna spread some garlic cloves all over. smelling heavenly already all right and now all our green spices so let's start with the dill oregano parsley basil sage thyme, rosemary, and majoram. And flip it over and use the remainder 
of these on the back. Maybe I went a little tad overboard with the spices. Usually I just eyeball it. I just wanted to show you guys what kind of spices I'm using and lay it all out. But the point here is not to use any red spices or anything else. It's a green chicken and you can peel the skin back a little bit, rub it into the breast. into the meat a little bit and now I'm gonna let it marinate for about an hour or two you can even do it overnight if you want to prepare dinner before the day before so you don't have to do it maybe when you get from work then you can leave that overnight as well um, right now I'm doing this in the afternoon and we're gonna have dinner tonight so I'm gonna let it marinate and then we'll be back with the rest it's been two hours since I started marinating the chicken right now I'm gonna start roasting it I've put a little bit of water around just to keep it moist and you can lift it with a fork or spoon just so it goes under. And I have my oven preheated to 375 and I'm gonna roast it for 50 to 80 minutes. I'm gonna start checking at about 50 minutes with a thermometer at the thickest part for it to reach 160 or 165. If it's 160 and you're gonna let it rest, you can pull it out at 160 and cover it with foil, let it rest, and it's going to be very juicy. Or you can pull it out at 165 and start eating it right away. If it starts burning up on top too much, you can always put a little bit of aluminum foil towards the end. All right, so I just pulled the green chicken out of the oven, or herb chicken, green chicken, and it smells heavenly. It was baking for an hour at 375. I used the thermometer. It was 170 actually, so I could have done it at 50 minutes. And I just want to show you how juicy, ouch, kind of hot, how juicy it is. Ah, you know what? Let me grab a paper towel because it's way too hot for me to hold it. Do you see how juicy this is? Oh, yum. And here's dinner. Mmm. Enjoy.